All right, so if you watched my previous video, then you know I just got a big uh, eBay score of these uh, Serpent Impacts, or 835s. 10 scale, 235 millimeter. Uh, they don't make these anymore, so they're kind of hard to come by. But a few things I want to address first is the standard pipe. I want to use my freeze method I did in another video to fix that. And usually the first thing I do when I get these eBay scores, I, uh, I take the tanks out and I ultrasonic clean the uh, tanks. So I have two tanks to clean, and uh, if you saw the other video, then you know I have a box of parts, probably enough to build two or three of these cars. So, um, at least two, I think, for sure. Three, maybe. Alright, All right, so this is one of the most important things, because uh, the worst thing you can do is put dirt in your carburetor, and in your engine. Remember, it's a two-stroke, it's going to scuff everything. So it won't just scuff the, the cylinder and the piston, it's going to scuff the crankshaft, the crankshaft bearing, all that stuff. Alright, that's the uh, boxer there where the wires pulled out. That's the underside with the battery. The new battery got a 1700 milliamp hour. That's the bottom servo. And actually I designed these, so go to my Thingiverse page and you'll, uh, the servo locks. It's like a little, uh, this is, this is, this, these are actually low profile. And these are the bigger ones I made, but they have a little notch on them. And they fit, that little notch, ah oh, shit, in the server right there. They also have low profile ones. Those are the low profile ones. Alright, and they fit. I'm just gonna go back there. Hi guys, yeah. Serpent's done. Serpent Impact. So I gotta make some adjustments there. Gotta put some fuel hose on there. Um, and I also have this RB Novorossi air cleaner. I was hoping to get a black one, but this thing was only like uh, six dollars. So, got two of those for both the cars, and gotta get that one done. But that's gonna take me a while because I'm just getting parts. I'm actually also 3D printing parts for things I can't find anymore. So, like this rail right here, I'm gonna have to probably 3D print that, design it, or make it in Fusion 360 and to print it out. And then I have, uh, I actually might put one of these uh, just to see how much difference it will make it put it like you know they're both big blocks but normally this thing came with like a 15 put like a 21 in there put this rb21 in there it will fit in there you know it's enormous just a big cooling head but it will, it will fit in there and that's the 15 that's going to go in there that i powder coated but i still need to get a cooling head i guess i could take the cooling head, this one take that thing off and just put that on there but I want to clean the cooling head up first. So that's probably what I'll do, end up doing. Is I'll probably end up putting this 15 and also the uh, Nova 21. All right, guys. Finally ready to fire up this serpent. It's been a couple weeks. I had to buy a bump box, batteries, how to do a conversion, added this to it, all kinds of stuff. Servos or a box that's reprinted that stuff. A lot of a lot of work. A different receiver. So I think I'm finally ready to go with this thing. So let's turn this bump box on. Make sure that works. Okay, I have some uh, Byron 20% nitro. I do actually have 30% nitro too, but I don't know how those things are going to react. So, all right, turn the receiver on. Okay, get the glow plug on. But I'm not getting fuel. So I'm guessing the carburetor's gummed up because I actually I can I can blow on this thing and it feels like it's definitely clogged up here in the carburetor. So um, I mean I never took this part carburetor apart to clean it like the other ones. So what I'll do is I'll take the high speed needle out this thing and I'll throw some cleaner down there. Alright, spray a little cleaner down the high speed needle. Looks like the flow is good now in the carburetor. Get the glow plug night around there. Shit, there's fuel in the line now. Alright, let's check this thing out. Alright, 